Yo, alright boys, I'm back from the break and I just want to say before the start, if you all want to follow me on Instagram, that'd be greatly appreciated. It's the official Instagram page for my YouTube channel, so you can get updates whenever you'd like. I'll leave a link in the description down below, and also, the Nether update came out on consoles, if you guys want me to check it out, let me know, like, text me or comment or something, and uh, enjoy the rest of the video. Hadn't a fucking notion what I wanted to do, so I set my sights on the eventual end goal of becoming Donkey and fucking the Ender Dragon until I couldn't move. Like an idiot though, I jam packed my inventory so I couldn't carry him with gels because uh, I'm a fucking dope. Did I mention the OG bonk stick has fire aspect? I think this speaks for itself. Everywhere is hostile! And so I set off in search of a desert. Endermen tend to spawn a hell of a lot more in the desert than anything else. Although, if there's not one close by, I have an idea what I can do off camera. Realised of all the fucking things I packed and not one of them was filled. Tree Drown tried to jump me for my lunch money but uh, none of them succeeded. Every fucking time I see a tropical reef I always think it's a fucking ocean temple. You know, come to think of it we've been actually pretty unlucky with some structures in this world. Like I guess there's tons of sunken ships and shit but there's no like villages or you know anything else. Turned off my music to listen to the wonderful sounds of Minecraft. Then I turned it back on because Minecraft never bothers this fucking arse to play its own music. As the rain poured and the lightning struck, I came across a village, which I quickly went over to. Hmm, weird, there's no light sources there. I thought, but little did I know, it was abandoned. Right at the blacksmith's gaff, you had the grindstone, general shite, none really. Wait until your man with the armor won, because then I could just take him out easily. It's called tactics, not being a pussy, I swear. Man, the risk I took was calculated, but boy, I'm not bad at math. I guess it was more luck than anything that I found tons of food. Oh, also, I took their composters, even though I'm not sure what they do, but they have it for a reason, so, you know. Explored a fair bit of the village, then seeing something I really wanted. Glad I brought a fishing rod. His name is Mittens, and I love him. Got a cartographer's table, which helps me make maps or some shit. Wanted another one of these because I want to flex on people. Found a shite ton of food. I know where the farmer lives anyways, fucking hell. After pillaging the village, I decided it was time to enforce communism by again stealing their... Wait, hold on, is it really stealing if they're already dead? Alright, let me try this again, hold on, hold on. After grave robbing like everything, I also grave robbed the wheat and made mountains of bread from it. Put mittens in the boat and decided to do one last sweep in case I missed anything because I'm a greedy bastard. Something mentally scarring happened to the stream, fucking hell, had a stroke. Found an underwater house and decided to do it with the slow way for some reason. The, well, I say loop, but there was none actually inside. You know, the thing about cats is, is, well, they grow up so fast. Did I mention me compasses decided to stop working? Yeah, well, they did. So you can put a map or like arrows in your offhand, right, or torches I think, but you can't put your fucking compass there, like what? Just, just watch the compasses real quick. Decided to hop into what I- OH MY GOD I COULD'VE FUCKING DIED! Does this count as cheating? Hmm. Stream had loads of fucking seizures, Jesus. This would seem familiar, and I'd make a joke about it, but what the actual fuck is the stream doing? Discovered the red bushes hate me as much as everything else does. Accidentally did this. Here's a comparison between my house's coordinates versus mine here and now. Jinkies, I'm miles away. Also, my compass has started working for some reason. Yo, dog, I heard you like chests, so I put a chest on a chest. Swapped out my old rod for a new one with look at the sea on it. Finally, home. I can see it. I'm really there for fuck's sake, the stupid fucking cunt. Dug a pathway up for me cat and then realised he could teleport to me. As it turns out, cats in Minecraft like beds. Filled in my creeper hole. Played a mean prank on a zombie. Decided to head out on land this time. Left me horse somewhere safe while I dealt with a certain menace. I fucking decimated the bastards like it was nothing. I also got my hands on the first bottle of enchanting I've ever seen to be naturally generated. I must have updated it or something. 
With my armor mostly nearly broken, I decided to make my way home, although you don't see it because the stream decided to commit die. 